two, three, and then number four is going to come back down. Got it. And that should give us access. I'm hoping. Yep. Not much time though. Got it. We're in. Yes. Mm -mm. Party time. Oh, <laughs> you'll find that hard to believe what? within the next few chapters. Mm hmm. Yeah. <laughs> that kind of gives it away. Plus, I already spoil it to you guys. <laughs> I told you what's waiting downstairs. Go. This is the the chapter which I find, graphically speaking, the coolest one of them all. Because, again, I'm gonna I'm not gonna spoil it. Spoil it. You're gonna see. You're gonna find out soon enough. I would like my guns back now. Thank you very much. Hang on. No! I wanted to check the terminal. I messed up. But do synths hug you in this chapter? No. Samuels was the only hug friendly synthetic in the entire game. Well, I guess it depends on how you define hugging. If you define it as choking, beating, ripping, sure, you're gonna see lots of hugs. You want cargo? Uh, anyway, what's the news? The new Yutani protocols. Six is sold out. They're in control of Apollo now. It's refusing to lift the lockdown. It says there's something up with the reactor. <laughs> Free hugs! I like hugs. I'm a big hugger myself, so... Hugs for all! I think that was a stream of one of my previous um, Alien live streams, wasn't it? Alien hugs for all? Yeah. The alien loves hugging. But more than that, it loves smooching. Kissing, yeah. 
And oddly enough, it loves French kissing. It's kind of awkward. Oh, shotgun shells. Forgot, I don't have my weapons with me. Okay, there's nothing over here. Oh, hang on, I know what we're gonna get. We're gonna get the, um, the bolt gun now, isn't it? I think we're gonna get the bolt gun soon. Like, really soon. <laughs> soon being now. <gasps> no! I'm unarmed, don't touch me. I've got nothing, I've got nothing. I've got nothing. I don't even have EMP mines. I've got one Molotov and that would be a huge waste of a good Molotov. Uh, no! Where is he? He's coming. Isn't he? Yeah. Oh, he's going around. Oh, shit. Shit. Uh, if I had known... I would have just run around. Okay, go, 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 go. Hurry up. I'm gonna use the med kit. The last one. There should be a bolt gun somewhere. Like, I know there's a bolt gun in here. Because we're gonna be able to use it in the core. Oh, crap. I'm gonna die. Yep, I'm gonna die. Oh. Find an upgrade for the the ion torch. Oh, I got it. Over here. No, hey, I'm dead. I'm dead. It's over. He got me. He got me. Yeah, it's over. Almost. Oh my god, I could make a med kit if I wanted to. I really thought that was it. Not yet, so it seems. Oh shit. No, 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 no. I'm dead. I'm dead. And now he's gonna choke me to death. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or break my neck. Ah. Okay. So. There's no bolt gun in here. It's closed though. Okay, so all we need to do is grab the ion torch upgrade. Okay. Mm-hmm. We know. Oh wait, yeah. I need to turn on the power again. Uno. Dos. Tres. 
choo 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 come on let's go come on come on come on there we go I'm gonna hit the save station first of all which I didn't No, <laughs> come on, open up again. Yep. And then Okay, so one of the I should say the only android in here is in this room to our right. There he is. Yeah, sure, it always requires your attention, you dumb synthetic. Uh-oh. There he is, there he is, there he is, there he is. Ouch! You bitch. Climb inside, go, 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 go. <sighs> Alright. I don't have much time. I think he's inside this room. The one in the middle. It sounds like the sounds coming from there. <sighs> Hang on, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna grab the injector. And we're gonna try and uh, sneak around him because cutting through through the panel with the ion ion torch is gonna take us a while. And we do not have the means to take him out. If I had an EMP mine or a stun bat baton charge, this would have been much easier, but we don't. So, unless I'm missing something over here, just one stun bat baton charge is all I need. Oh, wait, maybe I can distract him. Okay, what does this do? Camera feed off unstable system. I have no idea what that did. I don't know. But at least it turned off the cameras, which should help. Okay. <laughs> you always say that. Alright, hang on, I'm gonna run around. I'm gonna make him follow me through here. And as soon as he comes inside, I'm gonna sprint towards the hatch. The, the vent hatch, I should say, and climb inside. Alright. And then I'm gonna exit through the hatch. Just hope he didn't see me. Where's he gone? Off to? Okay, he's inside the middle room. He's relentless, isn't he? Looks like I only turned off one of the cameras. Maybe it is time to use one of the um, noisemakers. Right, let's use one. Come on, go investigate. What is he doing? You are the most stubborn synthetic I've met in this game so far. Stubborn... Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh my god. I did make the alarm go off. Yeah. No, I'm not giving it a hug. I'm only giving Samuels a hug. We've been through this before. The only synthetic who was getting a hug from me is Samuels and he died. <gasps> no! 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 No, no, no! 
I'm gonna die. 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 I cannot believe this. We're almost through. Oh my god. All we need to do is just sprint. And climb inside. Yeah, you're too late, buddy. You're too late. Made it. Thank you, God. safe station thank you there's not there's another one right there and again I've got nothing to fight him with Not even when you're choking them. I'm trying to look at him at the same time, it's hard. Powered up the controls. And I'm guessing we need to power up this. No. Oh, come on, you did not see me for just peeking, did you? No. Come on, no. Power level too low. What? Oh, hang on. No. Restore power. Shit. 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 That's good. That's okay, Missa. Everyone gets hugs from me. Everyone. Hugs for all. As long as I can make it out of here. I really need... Ugh. I just want to power up the stupid workshop controls. Please. Screw it. Just let me, just let me hide back inside. Come on. We're not taking any risks. Hi. Oh, you failed. Huh. I don't like mo I don't like mocking people except when they're really evil. Like you. You stupid synthetic. Hi. Come on. There's one problem. He's guarding the vent now. <laughs> it's our only way out. So... <sighs> Looks like we're waiting. Did he leave? Good. 
Right, I'm gonna hit the save station again. Just to play it safe. At least this way there's gonna be less trial and error and actual progression. Oh my god, no! Would you just leave? I'm sick of you. Let's wait a little, little longer until he actually leaves. Yes. I'm gonna hit the save station again. Okay. So all I need to do is go to the back, right there behind this um, the the car. Power up the controls and then hit the um. What is it? The, the generator on the other side and then we should be safe I'm not gonna run not gonna run oh he saw me alright guys you're gonna have to <laughs> Give me the time to, to do this in with small pauses in between, or I'm not gonna make it. All we need to do is start up the generator, and we're safe. Almost, that is. <sighs> yeah, neither is killing, as far as I'm. As far as I know, he talks about crawling in ducts and vents is unauthorized. Yet yeah, he goes around killing people. Hypocritical, stupid, synthetic crapper. Go on, get, get on out of here. Okay, I got time, I got time. Yoink. Did it. Alright. Now. I'm just waiting. No, you did not see me. Please, don't tell me you saw me. No! 
I don't care, I saved. If I die, I'm gonna be able to restart um, just where I left off right here. So. Where is he? I need to get a fix on him before I move. I think he just saw me. Yes. I don't care. Kill me. Sure. Go ahead. Give me your best shot. Go. Come on. You know what? I'm gonna take my chances. I'm gonna start the generator up. Or I'm gonna try at least. Come on. I'm dead. I'm dead, man. Or dead woman, I should say. Yep. I, I can hear him beating on me. Oh. Okay, well, I'm guessing I, I didn't make it, but... You know, my health is so low, and I've got... No med kits left. Should I go for it? No, sure, what the hell, why not? Let's just do it. Let's go for it. This is gonna make entering the core so much tougher. the ladder up 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 <laughs> use the torch Holding it down. Oh my god, it leads back there. Nope. Bad call, Joa. Bad call. Oh, safe station. Thank you. Okay, I can do that, as long as you give me my bolt gun. <gasps> no! Oh, I'm never gonna make it, I'm never gonna make it. Okay, I, I'm fortunate this guy is really slow, so I'm just gonna run around grab the bolt gun and then shoot him in the face go 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 hurry up he's coming he's coming gotcha yes Sixty-eight thirty-two. Rick a dig a dig a dig dig. I've got my bolt gun. Now all I need is the rest of my stuff. My pistol, my flamethrower basically anything that gives me a fighting chance. Hang on, guys. Okay. Reactor access. This way.
What did it say? Control relay number three. Okay. No supplies. Calling a, a lavatore. Ricardo, you ever been to the reactor? Down we go. I did some training in one. Seems like a lifetime ago. Hello. Hello, anybody, anybody here? Transit station. <laughs> There's my stuff. There it is. Thank you so much. The only thing I'm missing is my flamethrower. Shame. And the flamethrower's not in here. Nope. Okay. Bolt gun ammo. Yes. Now this is a pretty cool level. Visually speaking, that is. Nothing. Got some androids, core control systems, business as usual. Mm-hmm. Have to explore the lower level. Yes. Now this is a tough level. Why? Because we have to deal with so many different. Uh, synthetics. You can see there's like one over here, there's one over there. I wish I could zoom in so I could show you. There's one over here. Uh, it looks like there's one back here. I'm guessing there's one over here. Is it? Like I can see two of them. There's one over here and there's one over here. There might be another one over here on this this walkway. Um, we're gonna try. We're gonna see what happens. Right, I'm gonna take this guy out. Oh crap. I think I just attracted the attention of all the other ones. Help me. Reload, 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 reload. You don't have any time to waste. Right, that's it for the bolt gun ammo. Shotgun time. No! No! He killed me. We're actually in mission number 14 out of 19. That's pretty good. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Okay. Let's try it again, shall we? Okay, so we need to deal with four of them. From the looks of it. Nothing. It's a handle with some core control system. 
business is business as usual. We have to expand the lower level. Switch over to the shotgun. Here, synthetic here. What? Four shots. What a waste. I think that's all of them. <laughs> With the emphasis on pink. What am I doing? Okay, just descend. Gotcha. Easy peasy. Descending is easy, coming back up, that's the real problem. Okay, just checking for supplies. Okay, no supplies. No supplies. This is pretty much loose, useless until we come back up. So we are going to descend into what is probably the level that make me squeal like a little fangirl. Because I was like, oh, I'm hoping this level is in the game, and then it turned out to be. That's awesome. Oh yeah. Oh. oh yes. Oh yeah. This is, without a doubt, one of the coolest levels in the entire game. An alien nest. Ricardo, they're all here. Everyone that's missing. Everyone. They're trapped in some kind of nest. There are eggs. It's, it's like a farm. Not yet. Mm -hmm. Someone in chat asked for aliens. You got them. Going in the right, the right way. I am okay. Face hugger. Thank God I've got some idea of how much I have left. That, that stupid fire, <laughs> fire hugger. That stupid face hugger cost me thirty health, f fuel. Oh my god. My my brain it is shutting down pretty much.
Thank god I still at, still at least have some idea of what I'm doing in game. Another face hugger. Yeah, burn. Burn in hell. I'm missing something. Like I forgot to turn on the power somewhere. Oh wait, hang on. Disengage the locking mechanism first. It's one. Pretty much where we're gonna start pissing off the nest. As soon as we overload the beta core, they're all gonna go nuts. Oh my god! The aliens are coming! Aliens are much more scarier than... Oh my god. Oh my god! This is scary. I know it's just ambient sounds. It's not actual aliens running around in the game. But, this is one of the more creepier parts of the game. Hang on. Okay, I'm done. Okay, okay. Everything's fine. We're just gonna do what we've been doing so far. Regularly save. Slowly make progress. Overload the beta core. <laughs> Overload the beta core. <laughs> right, one of the nests, one of the eggs is closed, so I'm gonna set it on fire if it tends to open up. Now I know this really pisses off the aliens. Setting unopened eggs on fire really makes them freak out. Oh my god! Holy shit! Jesus!
That was seriously scary. Holy crap. That alien showed up out of nowhere. It's, it's the screeching sound that always gets to me, you know? That's when you know that they've spotted you and that you're in mortal danger. He's back there. I don't think he's over here. I think I'm safe over here. For now, that is. No ethanol again. Oh my god. <gasps> I can make a Molotov. I will... Oh shit. But I can make a medkit too. I feel like I'm gonna need the medkit more. Sorry. Alright, I'm gonna keep my flamethrower close. Check any bodies for stuff. <sighs> oh, hang on. I thought I heard an egg, an egg open. You're not gonna believe this. My best friend texted me and she said, Oh, you're fine in the nest. No, no, I'm not. Not really. Like. The nest is one of the scarier parts of the game. Scratch that, probably the scariest part of the whole game. Facehugger incoming. I knew it! What is that yes to, Misa? Let's just say you're acknowledging the fact that the nest is super scary. My god, there are like multiple aliens in this nest. I mean, makes sense there are multiple aliens in here, but... <sighs> I hate this. I'm really hoping there's a safe station nearby. I need a drink. And by a drink, I mean water, not alcohol. Important lesson, stay hydrated. <laughs> Especially when you're playing Alien Isolation. Just leave, just leave. The nest, yeah. The nest is super scary. I know. I know, Missa, I know. Please, let there be a safe station nearby. Safe station! There's a safe station! Hit hit the safe station! <sighs> okay, we saved. Don't be a wimp! I'm sorry. Who, who's always telling me to play instead of her? Who? Oh, what the heck? Don't be a wimp, she goes. <laughs> oh, we'll see. We will see. I'll make you share play this again and you're gonna... I'm gonna give you control. Even on easy. You're so playing this. I will set you on fire, you filthy alien. I swear it. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, you want to play Elder Scrolls Online, Tamriel Un Undivided, or wh what's it called again? Hang on, I've got the disc right here. Yeah, uh, Unlimited. The Elder Scrolls Online, Tamriel Unlimited. Yeah. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
Fine, fine, fine. I feel like if you can beat Outlast, you can beat this game. Because Outlast can be a really scary game as well. I mean, they're really different in terms of game mechanics and combat and stuff. <laughs> Mainly because Outlast does not have any combat mechanics at all. But still. In terms of atmosphere and horror, they're both similar to, s to some extent. Outlast wasn't even that bad. You think Alien Isolation is much Outlast, M Missa? Really? Yeah, true. We did it like seven times, and we're gonna do it like a couple more times probably. Now, yeah, I can I understand what you mean. Like Outlast has a lot of scripted events, like it's full of them, and and in Alien Isolation, the enemies are basically unpredictable because they have no set moving pattern. They they just hunt is what they do. So okay, maybe yeah, maybe Alien Isolation is a lot scarier than this game is. then again that's what it it should be you know again it took them more than 30 years to make the first decent alien game out there okay we're done we're done we're done oh, crap I need to turn on the power yeah true Chris Walker was That's because you, you know, you always had like the. Oh my God, the aliens keep jumping down. That's because Chris Walker had like those chain boots. Remember, and every time he was around, you would hear the. Tsh, 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 so you know, you knew that he was close. Yeah, I know. I need to get the generator, but the aliens just they they keep. I feel like I should use one of my flares or noisemakers now. I've been saving them up, I'm up for a long time. And if I use them now, that could give me some time to, to do all the stuff I need to do. Oh, hang on. I think the generator's this way, right? I've not been uh, through this hole yet. Just gonna equip my flamethrower just in case one of those stupid. <laughs> I can see how you can find Chris Walker scary if he has no <laughs> no pants on. <laughs> You're confusing him with with Traeger. That's the dude with no pants. The one who goes, buddy. <clears throat> and three. Alright, that's a generator. And there are no... Oh, wait, there are supplies here. Okay, I feel like I should really use a flare now. Seeing as how I'm figuratively swimming in them. I'm swimming in flares, especially since nightmares... Nightmare mode barely gives you any supplies at all, so... Right, I'm gonna do as much as I can um, until I'm gonna hit the save station again, just to be sure. Reload the beta core. Then I'm gonna do this. Then I'm gonna do this. And now I'm gonna hit the save station. I know, I know, we're leaving. Right, I saved, let's go, let's get out of here, let's go. Guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna run, I'm gonna run, I'm gonna do it.
Okay, I've got some fuel left. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... <laughs> Um, Missa, I've actually been practicing Outlast on insane mode yesterday. And yes, we're gonna do a run one of these days. We're gonna do it together. We're gonna do it on my save file and we're gonna do it on yours. And I already regret saying those words. <laughs> it's not that hard, you know, again, a lot of stuff is scripted, so... As long as you know how to get around certain enemies, it's not that hard. Go, 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 go. We made it out, out of the nest. Yes! Mm. Ah, beautiful. I got a trophy. I've got no idea which trophy I got. Now I want to know. Mind your step is what it's called. The heck, I've had this game ever since I had my PS4, which was Christmas last year. And... It's been months since I got a trophy for, for Alien Isolation. Mind your step. I'm sorry guys, I need to find out what this is. Ricardo, I can destroy the nest. Ripley, put yourself in enough danger today. I can power up all the cores, overload them, and then initiate a reactor purge. It'll destroy everything down there. Look, I'm not trying to persuade you out of this, Ripley. I'd just like if you didn't die. Mm-hmm. Yes. This is this what's going to happen. happen. That's there very kind of you. There are overflow circuits that feed excess power into the local capacitor banks on each tower. If I decouple them and discharge the system, the purge will be external. The nest is right in harm's way. Oh, thank you for following z tech z tech to kicks z tech to kicks I think I got that right. I hope I did. Hang on, I'm looking it up. Mind your step. It's a trophy I got. Navigate the re reactor maintenance without dying. Awesome. Wow. It actually took me six months to get that one. <laughs> Good. Oh, and Missa, um, Traeger is not that hard on insane mode. Like, I've watched a playthrough so far, and there are tougher parts. Like, really. The part with the fuses, I think it's, it's the toughest one on insane mode. Okay, here we go. No, no, not more of them. No. I've only got four shotgun shells. Four shotgun shells. Seven bullets. I don't have enough ammo to take these guys down. If there's more than two, and there are, I'm, I'm dead. Oh, no, my God. No! 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 Oh my word! Ouch! That's painful. <laughs> he was like, "Shh!" <sighs> this part is the toughest part in the game. Ricardo, I can destroy the nest. This. I can power up all the cores, overload them, and then initiate a reactor purge. What is impossible, Missa? This? Look, I'm not trying to persuade you out of this thing. Are you talking about um, the reactor? This is what's gonna happen. There are if you're talking about Outlast, we're gonna do it. I'm confident we're gonna do that. We're gonna be successful. This, however... A whole other story. Just find something to hold on to. Nothing. There's three more of them. Three more. Nah. We're gonna do it, Missa. You know why? Because I've been practicing so far. Even yesterday, when you got my my whistleblower DLC, 
Yeah, I know, Worldstar. The orange androids are stronger because they've got these special suits on. Like, they can absorb more damage. The thing is, it's harder for me on this difficulty because... The game hardly gives you any, any supplies. Plus, the orange droids, they're invincible to EMP mines. They're invincible to stun baton charges. So the only thing they're vulnerable to are, well, fire weapons, basically. <laughs> what? Okay. Misa, we're gonna we're gonna do the DLC together. How about that? Yeah. What do you think? I mean, not today, obviously, because you know you're out of time. But like tomorrow or Friday, we're gonna do it. Come and get me. Shit. All right. Friday's good. Now we're going to do it on Friday. Friday shall be out last day. Get away from me! Right, I'm gonna lure them around. All the way around. <laughs> no, I don't have... Define big rifle. If we're talking about the bolt gun, I've got it, but I've got no ammo for it, so... Pretty much useless now. All I want is for these guys to follow me now. I mean... Visually, spe I mean, audio visually speaking, it's an impressive level, the reactor level, but it's so damn hard. Especially on, on, on nightmare difficulty, like, wow. Oh, crap. I need to do the puzzle before the droids catch up on me. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Go, 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 go. No, 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 no. I'm wasting so much time. No. No, I, I can't do it. I can't do it. Get out. Get out. Get out. Where are they? See? They would have gotten to me. I just need all of them close. I need all of them to, like... get together so that I can lure them around and give me enough time to actually do the, do the puzzle because I mean wasting these bullets would be a shame oh crap are you kidding me I healed, so I've got a fighting chance or not. <laughs> Shit. This part's tough. Ricardo, I can destroy the nest. Put yourself in enough danger today. I can power up all the cores, overload them, and then initiate a reactor, reactor purge. It'll destroy everything down here, yada yada. Alright, I'm gonna use my shotgun again. There are emergency overflow circuits that feed excess power into the local capacitor banks on each tower. If I decouple them and discharge the system, I can try. But the nest is right in harm's way. Just find something to hold on to. Alright, let's let's just focus, yeah. Let's focus on getting through this. One. Two. Three. Alright, one down. Three to go. 
I did have to use three out of four shotgun shells. And believe me, seven revolver bullets are hardly enough. Even for two, let alone three, so... I mean, I can try. Right? This one. Ah, oh, crap! I'm gonna use the medkit again. Just to make sure. Okay. That's it. I've got one bullet left. And... 182 uh, f fuel for my flamethrower. Oh my gosh. Okay, I want to keep going. I want to keep doing this because I... I need to beat this game on nightmare mode. Like I, I said I would, and I want to get... I want to make good on that promise. So... 81... 80, 65... Alright. Where are they? There they are. Oh wait, the, the beta core has to be overloaded on this terminal? Yeah. That's two, that's two down. Two left. Three, four. Right, that's one core down. Just one more. One more core. One core. Basically, you're doomed. Thank you. Thank you, Dad. I, I appreciate that so much, Missa. Thank you. I love you, too. <laughs> Mucho amore. Right back at ya. That actually gives me the strength to push on now, so... I've got one shotgun shell, one revolver bullet, and 182 fuel. It's hardly enough to take down two androids. Never gonna do it. Yes, pray for me, Misa. Cross your fingers, please. If I can make it through this area in the game, I can... Pretty much make it to the finish. One thing's really upsetting me though. Like, I know where one of the one of the androids is. He's following me around. He's right there. Oh, there's a the second one. Okay, never mind. I'm good. Wow. Okay, I just want them to follow me around. So I can do the the final two consoles. Two consoles. That's all I need. Just time enough to do, to do the two remaining consoles. Alright, I'm gonna run over here. I'm gonna do the stupid puzzle. 41... 62... One more terminal. <laughs> one... Like, the one terminal. This one. If I can nail this puzzle, we're home free. Without dying, that is. We can do this. We can do this. Positive vibes, everyone. Positive vibes. Positive vibes. Don't take any unnecessary risks. Just let them come to you. And I'm stuck. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna waste any fuel on them. It would be such a waste. Alright, as soon... As soon as they hit this console... I'm gonna start running. Towards that console, I'm gonna try to solve the puzzle as soon as possible. I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna stand over here. Uh, there they are. There they are.
Yeah. Okay. Here we go. This is it, people. This is it. This is it, Missa. This is it. This is it. We need to do it. We need to do it. That's two. That's two down from the start. Two down. Three, four, three, three. Yes. 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 Go. 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 Run. Sprint. Get out of there. Wait. Read our redirect power. Wait. The what? The what now? Oh shit. Oh, I thought I had this. I thought I had this. No. No. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Oh, wait, I think I got it. The final puzzle's over here. Well, puzzle, it's a lever. It's just a lever. Okay, fine, fine. We're good. We're good. Did we do it? Please tell me we did it. Please tell me we did it. Initiate purge from reactor control. I, we did it. We did it. We're home free. Run, 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 run. I feel like there should be a crowd cheering me on right now. Yes, yes, we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it. Go, 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 go. Oh, there it is. Yes, yes. Mm, we did it. Positive vibes worked. Mm -mm -mm. Oh my gosh. <sighs> oh, now I'm super bummed there's no trophy for <laughs> finishing this game on nightmare mode. Because holy crap, that was insane. That was hard. I'm not even gonna lie, I got scared. Alright, and now let's let's approach this sucker. That's one. And this one. Purging time. Hang tight. Here we go. Now this is also really cool. And here come the aliens. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Missa, if we can do this, we can pull off Outlast on Insane. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Awesome. We did it. Let's go. Here we come, Ricardo. Come on, let's go. Sorry guys, we've got some uh, unique memories of Ricardo. We laughed our asses off with him during our initial <laughs> playthrough together. Uh, Ricardo, you bastard. You lazy bastard. 
Simat Tower. That's where we're going. Engineering Transit Station. Going to Engineering. Uh, he said we had to go to the Simat Tower. Medical, so... Holy crap, I, s I still cannot believe we pulled that off. The reactor core on, on nightmare mode. Like, like, wow. I only used three shotgun shells to... to make it through five androids. Five androids on top of that in, in orange suits. In hazmat suits. Oh my god. Uh, and I'm gonna save, first of all. Like, I... If I died now and had to do the entire reactor core again, I would have been so bummed. I'm guessing this is the way to go. <laughs> Look at it from a different perspective, Serene. This is what happens when Joa has to deal with an army of androids from behind. If I can do this, I can do Outlast on Insane. Pretty sure. Oh, that crack. Oh. Bring it. I'm ready for more. Ha. Ah. Here we go. it is. If we, if we can do this, we can do Outlast. I'm sure of it. Like, I was doing it yesterday. Just before I got off, I made it to the sewers on insane mode. <laughs> There's a balance, Misa. Because alien... Um, might feature checkpoints, but the AI is much more unpredictable. Whereas, you know, the encounters in um, in Outlast they're very much scripted, and you can kind of work around that by knowing how they will scout and how they will respond and how they will move around. And they always use the, the same patterns. So, I'll prove it to you. We'll do it on Friday. We will. Alright, going to the primary care floor. Also, there's a difference in length. Like, you can basically do Outlast on, not on Insane in under two hours. You can pretty much, much rush the sections in the game. Meh. Has multiple enemy enemies. Mm. Yes and no. Most of the time you're only dealing with, what is it, two enemies or three ta three enemies at a time. I just had to deal with four or, f or five androids uh, at the same time. With barely any supplies, I have to add. Find an ambulance craft. Okay, sure. You'll see. We're gonna do it. We're gonna finish out last on insane. We're gonna do it together. And we shall be victorious, because that's what we are. We are victorious. Alright, I know the aliens are back inside the facility. 
inside the station, so I'm prepared. <laughs> yes, agreed. Traeger needs pants. Dr. Traeger seriously needs some pants. And this one has a British accent. An uh, accident. Accent. Oh my god. My brain's been failing me ever since I started playing this game today. Ah, oh, I've been going all kinds of cuckoo. Don't run. Like I had it the first time around, I said accent, and then I was like, no, it's not the right word, it's accident. And then I totally broke down. Oh shit, I should not have moved. Oh my god. Come on, come on, come on! Come on! Leave, you dumb bitch! Ugh. I hate the freaking alien. Now that was my upset voice. Not, not many people ever hear my upset voice. You guys did because the alien really started to piss me off. I was like, no, 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 stay away. Okay, I know where it is. I know where the the shuttle's at. It's right around the corner. Getting a bit hot on the, <laughs> getting a bit hot under the under the collar, Joa. Getting a bit hot, are you, laddie? No, oh, the alien. The alien starting to piss me off. Is what he's, is what he's doing. He's right there. See. I heard the hissing coming from one of the ducts. He's hiding, right there. Right, we're not gonna take any risks. We're not gonna. I just said we're not gonna take any risks, Joa. What the heck are you doing? I tried to take out my my motion tracker, and when I did, I noticed. Or I thought that, you know, I, rem I remembered that they can pick up on the noise your tracker makes. And that's when I put it away. I was like, nope. Alright, let's hope he doesn't turn around and come back. Because he tends to do that, you know, make a full 180 and come back to get you. The question is, where is... Okay, random... Oh my god! It's gotta be in here. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's in there! It, it's that door. I need, I need to get to that door. Oh. Okay, he left. He left, he left, he left, he left. Let's all just relax. Let's not do anything stupid. Get the... No! Get the passcode. Which passcode? Wait, hang on. Isn't this the level 3 upgrade? Yeah. It's close. Good. No, I don't think we need a passcode. We just needed the... The next upgrade. Now we can hack open this door. For fast enough, that is. Oh, he's coming. Oh, he's coming. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Damn it. This would have been a good time to use my flares. Like, I have five flares sitting in my inventory. I've been saving them up for the aliens. Ah, uh, all right. It's really did a number on this place. All right, I know what to do now. All right, so the alien can spawn in this area, so we're not gonna run. Obviously, 
We're not gonna use any weapons. All we're gonna do, just to play it safe. Don't run. See, even even the androids going. If you want to survive, don't run. I'm like, yes, sir. I understand that. That's what I've been doing. This is locked. So we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna lure him inside side of this room. Then we're gonna circle around. And we're just gonna walk. We're not gonna run. Even though I feel like running, especially. Oh god. Okay. Fine. We can go the other way around if you want to. He doesn't even. Oh my god. He doesn't even care, he's, he's just knocking down all of the boxes. Probably holding a lot of really valuable medical stuff. Like life-saving stuff, like penicillin and stuff. And you're like, nope, nope. Just gonna knock these boxes over. Why? Because I'm a jerk. Okay, no running, no running. Point one, do not run. Point two, avoid the ceiling hatches. Because the alien's really good as, at grabbing you through those. We haven't actually coaxed him yet, so we do have that working to our advantage. <laughs> Alright. Now before I died... <laughs> previously at this door, I wanted to say it's a good thing the alien doesn't pick up on your security access tuners noises. Alright, awesome. We made it. Just in case. Good. Good. So we're gonna head over to Marlowe's ship now. Which features no aliens, thank you. Thank you, God. Let's go get Marlowe. Even though he dies in about 15 minutes. Spoiler alert. Coming, Marlowe. Okay, save. Even though there's not much of a threat on this ship, aside from what is it, one or two. I always thought when I entered, entered this room that it looks like two xenomorphs sitting back to back. See? It looks like it, doesn't it? I'm thinking they... yeah, they, they must have designed it that way intentionally to kind of keep you on your toes because there's no way that these pipes and these wires and everything 
look like this co coincidentally. No, 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 no. They're supposed to look like aliens when you approach them like this. Pretty, pretty neat. You can't fool me though. I know there are no aliens on this ship. Aside from a few face huggers. Yeah, and you died in the end. What's this? Oh, shotgun shells. Yes. Don't mind if I do. Okay. Code. Forty-five ten. Okay. All right. We're gonna restart the generator. It's one. Two, three, boom. Right, lock in. Easy puzzles. And we're live. Ricardo, in case you're here, I've got the invincible its basic power systems back online. Door should be open. Hopefully some light. Still no sign of Marlo. Come here, Marlo, Marlo. Oh. Welcome to the Anisadora. Marlo? Where are you, Marlo? Thanks for switching the power back on. You saved me a job. I only needed it online temporarily. I had some things to fix. Maybe you want to join my crew. Let me have three spots. Sure, I'm coming. I'm coming, Marlo. I'm coming. Hmm, easy. <laughs> a three code hack. It's been a long time since I saw one of those. Finally, finish 
Minecraft, you know, their med kit. Boom. <laughs> Taylor had pretty much had the shittiest day one could have in a day. Wait. Taylor had pretty much had one of the most terrible days you could have in the universe of Alien. That's what I wanted to say. Yeah, Taylor's Day pretty much is on par with <laughs> Ripley's experiences. And with Ripley, I mean like Mother Ripley. Ellen Ripley. With the only exception that Ellen Ripley basically survives. Somewhat. <laughs> and Taylor doesn't. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Sorry. You saw it coming. She was kind of screwed anyway. Power core. Here we go. Alright. This is the data she's been looking for. Spoiler Palooza. <laughs> for my daughter. Hi, Amanda. I'm recording this for you, my sweetheart. And I hope you get to hear it one day. You see, I, um, I got into trouble. Um, my ship. There was an accident, sweetheart, and, um, we found an alien creature who was very dangerous. And the only way we could stop it was to destroy the ship. Uh, I'm okay. I'm stuck on this lifeboat, long way out. But we had to destroy the ship. We had to destroy the Nostromo. We just couldn't risk bringing that thing home with us. I needed to protect you. Don't worry. Don't worry about me. I'm sure I'll see you very soon. I love you, Bam! Wrench to the face. Misa, nothing can, nothing can beat Mufasa's death. Pretty much, nothing can beat his death. So sad, so sad.
Alright, I need to hurry. Because we actually have to do this um, before time runs out. Okay, you're doing good, Taylor. Now switch the maintenance terminal from auto to manual. Do you see it? It'll be there, Taylor. Trust me. Hurry. Go. Go, 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 go. Five. No, sorry, nothing can beat me fast as death. Sorry. Nothing can. Hurry, 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 hurry. Okay. Done. Taylor. I feel for Taylor. She never stood a chance. <laughs> that's 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 a really <laughs> <laughs> nice knowing you, Taylor. Bye bye. Run, 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 run. And this part's pretty cool. We're down for the fact that Taylor died. Keep going, keep going. The only two people remaining, living people remaining on the ship, as far as I know, are Amanda Ripley, which is us, <laughs> and Ricardo, that lazy bastard. Like he's not even lifting a finger, and he's he's still he still draws breath. I, I can't. No. Always the same stuff with Ricardo. All right, back into the alien infested station. Mm-hmm. Find a way to contact the torrents. Get ready for more aliens, guys. Chuck. Chucka. <laughs> yeah, yada, yada, yada. This is the exit. Is it? No, it's not, is it? Find Ricardo. It's a big ship, guys. You can't just ask me to go find Ricardo on this huge station. Oh yeah, 
I remember this bit. What do they want? <laughs> Ricardo time. Ricardo time. Ricardo, Ricardo, Ricardo. You are such a lazy pig. Ricardo, Ricardo, Ricardo. Oh, is someone actually twitching over here? Look. He's actually just sitting there going out of his mind going, No, the alien's gonna grab us. No, no. <gasps> oh crap. Okay, thank God. Just don't come around to the front. Ricardo, Ricardo, Ricardo. Should I? I'm just gonna try it anyway. Shit. I'm leaving. I'm gone. Look. I'm gone. I'm so gone. Look, I'm out of here. The problem is if they start shooting up the place. I was just about to say, if they start shooting up the place, the alien's gonna show up as well. Or one of the aliens, I should say. That might actually help. What, what if I took out a noisemaker and actually lured... Was <laughs> yes! He was. He was actually faking it. He was going... I see you! That's so low. So low. Okay. I say we try it anyway. We get inside here. We... throw a noisemaker down the hall and then we hide. And then see if the alien pops up. It sh it should, seeing as how the a the entire station is now infested with aliens anyway. Under the desk. You want me to hide under the desk? What the heck? Now he's twitching on uh, over on the other side. Look. What the heck? Alright, let's try it. I'm just gonna go around. See, now he's sitting over here. I could hide under this desk, I think. And wait for this guy to move. He's the bait. Should I do it? Oh, I really want to try it. I really just want to throw a noisemaker down the corridor and then watch chaos ensue. Let's try it. Let, let's try it. Let's try it. I don't care. If I have to shoot this guy in the face to get through, I will. Oh my god. No!
my god. I made it through. I have no flamethrower. Oh, I have some flamethrower fuel left. I did. I did throw my um, my noisemaker, but it didn't help. He didn't show. He's probably gonna show up when I when I go back. I'm just one ingredient short, or one component short, I should say, of making a med kit, which kind of sucks. So I'm hoping. Wait, hang on. I know there's a safe station on the, at the top of these stairs. Yeah. That for a fact I did know. That's good. Okay, I'm gonna save. Alright, no enemies so far. Uh, okay, what's in here? Give me something good. Nothing. Oh, here's Ricardo, by the way. Sitting on his, on his lazy ass, doing nothing. <laughs> hey, Missa, it actually works. I just set everyone on fire and I got out. I mean, I wasted so much fuel, but I made it. Mm -hmm. Oh, I remember this part. This is where we made so much fun of Ricardo. Mm -hmm. You do that. Open the door. Why don't you? Thank you. <laughs> you know what's coming up next. Ah, Ricardo. And we actually know what happens to Ricardo as well. But we were laughing so hard, we didn't even care about his, his fate. Uh. <laughs> Good memories. Ricardo! <sighs> Ding! Alright, comms control. This is where we get to do our spacewalk. Oh crap. Oh, okay, there are still humans left, other humans. I'm sure, if I can remember this, we have to go inside here and then use the suits to go outside, except it's locked. Don't tell me I have to go back around. Torch, torch. Torch is good. I like a torch. Alright, turning it off. Yeah, open up. Then this room is gonna... It's gonna detach from the station and go up. Compound B... Nope. That's not what I needed. I think I need bonding agent. Yeah. So now we're going to do this. Got it. This is gonna lock. 
And off we go. No, not yet. Oh wait, maybe... Soon... As we do these little mini-games... Yep, here we go. Going up. Okay. Bing bingo. Oh yeah. Okay. Come on. Yes. Mm-hmm. Hurry up. I'm waiting. All right. You know you enjoyed making fun of him. Because he kind of deserves it. I mean... He's not even armed. Doesn't even have a gun. All he does is hide behind, you know, under his desk. And the real hero of this game right here is Amanda. She's doing all the heavy work. Put it on. Let's go. Oh, I am going to save. Absolutely. How mean. It's true. I mean, what does he do? Ricardo, all he does is just sit on his chair. Punches in a few commands and goes, okay, the, the, the door's open now. Good luck. Good luck. Right, here we go. This is where we start making fun of him. <laughs> where we're going. He is still helping, but don't even don't even deny it. You were laughing as well when I went. Ripley, you're doing great work. Keep it up. <laughs> the only thing I will say is that he does die a, a pretty horrible death.